Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. To myself. What a wonderful So today's video is actually going to be a homeworks haul. And as you can see here, I have two special guests. This is Mia. We are watching her right now for a family member. But this is Kai. You guys know Kai. You might not be able to see him because of the box. But this is the box that I just got in from Homeworks today. I'm so excited. I got a really good deal on candles. They sent me a 40% off coupon code. So all my candles were $18. I even got 40% off the shipping and 40% off of... Or it was free shipping and 40% off of the package protection that they put on all of their um, packages that you can opt into or out of. But I decided to opt into them because I have heard that people have gotten them broken before, mostly if they shipped from Ulta. But I bought mine directly from the Homeworks website. So I got four four wick candles and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. So I just brought the box up here because I wanted to show you guys how they package them. Um, this is the best packaging I've ever seen for a candle in my life. So let me take this one out. But they all came in their own individual boxes within the big box. And then the big box had a bunch of this tissue on top of it um, to make sure all the little boxes didn't move around. And then the candle itself was wrapped in its own piece of tissue and with a piece of tissue on top. So these candles arrived impeccably. like absolutely amazing so i'm gonna start off with the one that i've been wanting for the longest time from homeworks and that is hot cider donut and i'm so excited to have my hands on this i've looked at it every single time i go into ulta i'm always thinking about this candle because i love fall scents that's my favorite time of year time of year i think i'm gonna save this for the fall because i actually don't own any more fall scents i burned through all of them so I think I'm gonna save this, but I definitely wanna try it out first and see how it is and then you know save it to finish in fall. But yeah, this is the first one I got. So the notes are on the bottom and for reference, these are I think 18 ounce, yeah, 18 ounce candles burns for 30 to 55 hours, it says. Um, the scent notes are harvest apple, cinnamon sugar, vanilla bean, and spiced cider. And also another thing to note, it comes with a like wick protection sleeve so it like has this piece of plastic on top that keeps the wicks from being damaged um, in shipping. And then it also has a dust cover on top of that, which there we go, I can get it off. Oh my gosh, this smells delicious. Now I have not had the Bath and Body Works. Um, I didn't get the, hot, the cider donut one that they had last year. And I also have not had the Cider Lane one, um, but I did smell the donut one last year and it smells similar. But I honestly think this one is a little more donut-y than that one was. It smells impeccable. It smells so yummy. Mm, there's like that perfect mix of cider in there. It's not, it's not um, pumpkin-y at all. It's just like apple, that apple cider note, cinnamon sugar, and oh, it smells so good. So I'm very excited to burn this one. This I, I've been wanting this one for the longest time. And even if you get them on sale at Ulta, they'll still be $20 a piece. Like sometimes they'll do a two for 40 deal. So I got this for 18, so I still got it on a better deal than if I got it from Ulta. Okay, the next one I got, which I was also very excited about, is Lemon Cello Cupcake. This one is new for their summer collection. And the notes are Lemon Cello, Sicilian Lemons, Candied Lemons, Creamy Vanilla, and Baked Cupcake. This one I was excited about because I do actually really enjoy lemon scents, especially if they're ones that can like clear out the scent of like cooking. We love to use those in our house um, just because if we're cooking something like intense, it it gets throughout the entire house. I live in a three-story townhome, so it goes all the way up to the bedroom and you can smell it. So I like to have something strong. I usually will do like champagne toast or strawberry pound cake. Right now I actually have island margarita as my like um, citrusy kind of thing to get rid of scents from cooking so I wanted to try this one out because I figured it would be nice for that but it's also gourmand and I'm really not getting the most buttercream like cupcake note I'm really not getting that I'm getting more limoncello like I'm almost getting the kitchen lemon scent from Bath and Body Works so I'm thinking maybe this one the um, gourmand part will come out when I burn it but right now it's really just giving me limoncello 
nothing else. So we'll see if that cupcake note comes out a little bit later, but that's Limoncello Cupcake. Okay, the next one I got is a chocolate birthday cake. Now, I really love their packaging. I think it's so beautiful how they did this cupcake, not cupcake, this birthday cake with like sprinkles on the side and drizzling, um, drizzling like hot fudge down the sides. I thought that was really smart. And when I unbox this one, I could smell it immediately without even having to open up the lid. So, and this one has some weird like super long wicks. I don't know what that's about, but it smells so chocolatey. Okay, let me read you the notes. We've got dark and milk chocolate, espresso powder, warm vanilla, and whipped cream. So this kind of reminds me of like if you had a chocolate cake, a chocolate cake with espresso frosting on the inside. Mm. And then chocolate frosting on the outside or like maybe a dark chocolate cake espresso frosting and milk chocolate frosting on the outside i don't know it smells so good though mm. and i haven't had a chocolate scent for a long time i think the last one i had was um what's it called hot hot cocoa and cream from like three years ago it was actually hot cocoa and scream from the halloween time at bath and body Works. so i've been craving a chocolate candle for a while and I almost got chocolate banana mudslide, but it's just a little weird for me. It's too much like banana runts and that's not like my favorite scent. So I'm really excited to burn this one. It smells delicious and yeah, very excited. And the last candle I got was expertly wrapped. They had the lid separate from the actual candle votive because it is a glass lid. It's the kind of that hobnail material that um, some of the Bath & Body Works candles came in last um, winter. So it's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And they definitely protected this one so it would not come damaged. So I really enjoy that about at least ordering this order from the Homeworks website. Everything came impeccably shipped. So this one is a raspberry Linzer cookie. I think that's how you say it. I hope that's how you say it. But it is fresh raspberry almond cream, brown sugar, and baked cookie. This one sounded so yummy. And here's a little close up of the um, packaging. I'm gonna keep the lid off, but here it is. And it has, oh gosh, let me hold it. And it has the Homeworks like little H monogram thing on it. But I'm gonna keep the lid off because it makes too much noise. This one, I can't smell it too much. And that could be because it's just been shipped. So maybe it needs to sit a little bit, but I'm definitely getting like a raspberry almost a raspberry gelatin or like a raspberry filling, raspberry compote, something like that. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, but I'm not getting a lot of like almond cream or brown sugar. I do get a little bit of cookie, so I get like raspberry filling and cookie, but that's about all I get right now. I think it just needs to sit for a little bit and then I'll burn it and see how it burns, but it's a very sophisticated scent so far. So I'm interested to see once I can actually sniff everything else, what it smells like. Okay, so that is everything for my Homeworks haul. I'm really excited to burn all these candles. Let me know if you want a review on any of them. I might go ahead and do a hot cider donut review probably sometime in the summer because I'm sure people will want to pick this up again when fall comes around. So I'll probably do a review of that one for sure. But let me know if you want a review of any of the other ones. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below your experience that you've had with Homeworks. If you've ever tried their candles before, what do you think of them? Do they last longer than Bath & Body Works? This is my first experience with them. So I don't really have too many opinions just yet but I'm excited to try them. So if you guys enjoyed this video, um, go ahead and like and subscribe down below and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.